MicroSurvey CAD 2017 introduces the concept of smart polylines. Just like with smart lines and arcs, if the points that a smart polyline is connected to are changed, the polyline will immediately update to stay connected to the adjusted points. So whether you are manually editing individual points, doing a mass operation such as a rotate, translate, or scale, recoordinating a traverse file, or performing a traverse adjustment, your connecting polylines will remain connected to the points. Smart polylines are created through various means, for example by importing a microsurvey field genius or like a Captivate project, by processing your automap library, by manually drawing a figure with a 3D curve command, by auto adding points to a polyline, or by auto labeling a polyline. Smart polylines can be labeled with the existing line labeling commands. For example, the auto bearing distance command will place a bearing and a distance label along every straight segment in the selected smart polyline. A new polyline information dialog has been added that gives pertinent details about your polylines. There's a lot of data here, but if you look at how it's broken down into different sections, it's not too overwhelming. At the top, basic details about the polyline are given. Polyline information shows the overall length and area of the entire polyline. Note that it is given both as drawn, which is based on the geometry of the polyline itself, and as computed, which is based on mathematical computations for any arc or spline sections in the polyline, since they are drawn using short segments that approximate the curvature. The segment information section shows details for each straight, arc, or splined segment and the vertex information section shows details for each vertex. So the data generally gets more granular as you progress down the dialog. Finally, the misclosure information section shows end-to-end -end closure data if your polyline is not closed.